Hey everybody, here we are. I'm um, making some more balloons. I gotta get these all ready for the um, farmer's market. And people tend to buy the smaller things because they're cheaper. It's just the way it goes. So, I went a little berserk and uh, I've made up a whole bunch of paint over here. I'm gonna be blooming all night long. Um, I don't have too many more of these little canvases though, so I'll have to do something different um, at some point. Um, I'm just throwing colors here and there. Um, this is the bronze I just made up using Master Touch bronze uh, paint. Not much of that. Alright, and um, I want to go with some of these that are just pigment because I'm experimenting. Um, I'm thinking that I won't need to add paint if I add, if my pigments are, um, um, what's the word? very concentrated. In other words, a whole lot of um, pigment powder and not much um, pouring medium with it. And I'm thinking that that is gonna um, make it where I don't need to add paint. Uh, I have like three different reds mixed up over here. I got, um, I went a little crazy. But I got new paints, you know, I got a couple of new paints today and I got new, um, um, well, no new pigments today, but new paints. And, um, you know how you are when you get new paints. Um, it's hard not to, you know, try them all out at one time. <laughs> all right. Let's pick it up. I'm getting a little carried away with this one. These little ones are fun to do, though. I mean, um, they're less stressful than the big ones. Okay. slanted if I put it up that way. But I don't know that for sure. It's pretty slanted. But it seems like it slants in a different way every day. I can't get it figured out. Okay, this one is just pigment. No, yes. I can't remember. Um, let me look at it. Yeah, that's pigment. Okay, fruit basket turner, we're going to get that one before it all runs off the side. Okay. And then i got to move this one before it runs off the side. <laughs> it's chaotic. I 
I like making these little ones. They're fun and um, they're not stressful and I just like them. They are, um, they're fun. I'll put a little gold in this one just for the heck of it and um, bit of purple and then I'll be done that is pigment only right there that is an eye candy uh, pigment I believe Alrighty. I'm running out of Amsterdam white and I've had some ordered for a long time from Amazon. Dip my chin in it again. In the paint. All right, let's get this one back and work on it. It's really pretty. It is raining out there. I can hear it. That's what's funny about East Texas weather. I mean, that's what they say about it. If you don't like the weather, just wait a minute. Because it changes so often. I'm not gonna move that so y'all can see here. Yeah, it just like changes like crazy. It's been beautiful all day, not a cloud in the sky. I can hear it out there now. This way. These are really pretty. I really like these pigments. Um, the colors, I mean, are really pretty. I keep trying to get up the nerve to get some golden paint. Um, you know, every now and then, I, I think I just need to try it, you know, because that stuff is so expensive. You know, and I just think I need to try it. I just need to know. You know what the difference is what the big deal is i probably won't ever do it but i'm happy with mine you know what i use i like my master's touch and my um you know i've got a good assortment of pigments and stuff like that and i'm happy with them i don't need to i guess i don't need to go nuts like that i mean that's that's really crazy expensive compared to, you know, um, I think when you get to that point, you know, I mean, there's other brands that are, you know, more reasonable that are just as good. I, I don't know, but I'm no, I don't know because I've never tried it, but that's just the way I feel. And it, it just, I just almost would feel obscene, <laughs> you know, spending that much when you could get more pain, you know, if you uh, use a different, if you went with a different brand, you can have you know, more paint than, I mean, just for one of those little bitty tubes, it's like, you know, 10 bucks or something, just for one of those little, like the size of a deco art, you know, metallic, whatever they are, eight ounces, three ounces, I don't, I'm not good with that kind of thinking, three ounces, 2.5 ounces or three ounces, something like that, I don't know, really, really damn small. Okay, that one is good. Let's work on this one. Um, let me move this one out so maybe y'all can see this one while we, while we work on it. Okay, we're going to go back down to that corner. Down there. 
So far, I, I think I've done pretty well with my color choices on these. I haven't bombed out. Every now and then, you know, everybody makes a misstep <laughs> with color and you end up I, I, it doesn't happen to me very often, but with these blooms, sometimes I just get to throw in paint, and, you know, you end up with something, you're like, what was I thinking? <laughs> Especially when I get in a hurry, like I have been tonight. I don't know why I'm in a hurry. Um, I guess because I know if I sit down or if I slow down, I'm going to crash because I've been going so fast and so hard all day long, and, um... I hadn't had much sleep since my car wreck, and that's all trying to catch up with you, you know. I like that that violet, um, that it's called Violence Violet. It's by Eye Candy. I like that. It's pretty. Um, I'm liking both of these. Um, Okay, kind of what I'm going to do with all this paint because I'm about out of these little canvases. i got some that are like the next size up. Um, I guess we'll switch to those. <laughs> Maybe do a swipe or blow hair dryer or something. I don't know. I'll get y'all down. I'll let you see. <clears throat> Here's one of the ones I did earlier. And there's another one. The other ones are drying in the other room, and when they get dry, I will definitely show them to y'all. I don't usually embellish these very much. Um, I think they're just beautiful, usually, just the way they are. And um, it, if I do, I'll put a little glitter, you know, real fine glitter. It's pretty. Or um, some little seed beads or something like that. But I don't, don't usually do much, because look at that. I mean... I just think it's just beautiful. And I don't know. I don't want to complicate them, you know. They're they're usually so complicated on their own, you know. Well, thanks for joining me, you guys. I appreciate it. Um, please tune in next time and have a great night.